Welcome guys to another tutorial in this Excel Tips and Tricks series 2019. In this tutorial, I am going to talk about the different ways to sort the data. Like sorting by color font, by color background before that, and lastly sorting by color icon. So let's jump into the tutorial. When you sort data in Excel, nearly always it means moving rows up and down and most of the time it means sorting by content but we can also sort on the basis of cell color for example row 4 has a color background yellow row 12 is green row 16 is orange and so on and we can sort by color font further down on this list for example row 37 there is a red font perhaps some more a bit later too we can sort on that basis and in column j we have got some conditional formatting errors now usually these are in sync with some kind of textual reference and we would probably sort on the basis of content but here too we have an option sorting by the icons that we see here let's imagine that we will deal first with the color before sorting any list Recommendation is you have an or with list recently. Just to make sure, click within it, press Ctrl A that highlights the entire contiguous data. Then press Ctrl plus period. What you don't want to have happen is to start the sorting process and eventually realize and perhaps at a later time that you only sorted part of the data. So pressing Ctrl plus A and then Control plus period and press that a few times simply gets you oriented with the data it's all contiguous that is good just before we are ready to sort we don't need to highlight the data necessarily just click within it and either go on the home tape to the choice off to the right sort and filter here and you can choose custom sort start the process that way or on the data tape the larger sort button right here it doesn't say custom sort but either of those buttons will lead us as i click this one into the sort dialog box now the color extends across every column so if we are going to be sorting by four different colors here we need to have at least four levels and furthermore the data that is not with any color background we want that to be sorted as well and we might as well use say the first column and that could be a reasonable way to sort certainly based on content let's add levels right now we can do it at the beginning if you wish one more time we have got three additional colors and we want to take care of the data without colors so the first four of these we want to sort by cell color one by one change these indicators not by content but cell color and the last one by cell values and in each case here employee name in the strict sense here it doesn't have to be employee name but let's say that's the way we would want the data to appear within each color in order by employee name so first color over here i want the greens to be on top then the yellows and then that sort of orange tan color and then the grays and all the others based on actual content click ok and we are about to see all the green rows together then the yellows then the oranges then the grays and there they are and all the others they are in order alphabetically by name if you wanted to sort by color font you would know how to do that based on the previous example but obviously we have got to make some changes jump back in here we only need to sort on two levels here just delete the lower levels and just click in here press delete above it and again and again just click in here press delete above and again and again we now want to sort on the basis of font color and that only is in column a so we want to be sure here to use employee name font color there is only one other one in there red and for the second level sort this is for all those without red font we would want to sort on cell values 
and we don't necessarily want to do that by employee name but we probably would most of the time so all the red fonts will be together and they will be alphabetical by name then all the others will be together and they will be alphabetical by name there we are so all the red fonts together and alphabetical and then all the others alphabetical by name in column j we have got icons here and loosely speaking the greens the green arrows here are in the top third of the numbers now that's based on value it doesn't mean we necessarily have an equal number of green red and yellow arrows here but the data based on content is divided into thirds so now let's suppose we wanted the middle third could you do that with regular sorting this is the question and the answer is not really you could sort the data on the basis of content and then go more or less to the middle but you would not know where the breakpoint is necessarily maybe doing something a little unusual but recognizing that we actually can sort by the icons so let's do it so back to that same sort button this time we want to sort based on the comp column compensation column exactly and not on font color basis but on conditional formatting icon and we might want the greens and i think that would probably be the choice most commonly used here we might want those on top and of course we could use that but i'm going to be a little bit contrary here and say let's put the middle ones first and then we want comp here a second time and then a third time now we don't necessarily need the third one here because every cell has an entry here and by default the one we don't choose will be at the bottom but let's suppose you want the middle ones and then the top ones granted and that's a little unusual but we can do that so that's comp here and although we don't really need the third one let's delete that so let's say we want the middle ones then the top ones conditional formatting icon here and we have got the yellows then the greens and we don't need this one down here so delete the level and there we are so we will see all the yellow arrows all the green arrows and then by default the reds will be on the bottom i will click the ok and we see what is happening there so easy to set up and easy to use and again most of the time you probably won't use that icon option but we saw the use for the other ones too that is sorting by color font by color background and of course lastly sorting by color icon the different ways to sort the data not necessarily based only on content hope so you have liked today's tutorial please subscribe to the channel and check the bell icon and leave a thumb up so that you don't ever miss the future updates from the engineering world.